Thank you, brothers, for being here. My name is Vince Courtney. It's my great honor to be in Laborers International Union Local Number 304 with Business Manager Fernando Estrada, <laughs> Oakland Mayor Gene Kwan, <laughs> and the greatest membership of the greatest union in the greatest country in the world. We're gearing up now. And the first message that we have is we're not interested in political rhetoric and game playing. We're interested in making sure our quarterback knows that we've got her back. Our quarterback understands that because she knows who we are, she knows what our needs are, that we're going to be there for her because we need people in those positions. We need elected officials who know who the laborers are, who know who Local 304 is, and who know how important it is for us to just have a fighting chance. Today, it really is my honor to introduce to you my brother, my friend, the business manager of Local 304, Fernando Estrada. Brothers, sisters, friends, and residents of Oakland. My name is Fernando Estrada, and I'm the business manager of Local 304 of the Labor International Union of North America. I am honored to address you all here. It is not often that people, especially the news media, are very interested in what we have to say. You see, we are the working poor. We are the community, we are the labor's union, and we also have a voice. And for that, I thank the media for showing up. The workers we represent and their families want very much to be heard. In this period of economic crisis, because it takes all of the folks away from their urgent situation, it changes economy, the whole conversation to back to work when they cannot afford to be out any longer. And finally, no recall. No! Because Mayor Kwan knows, the labor knows, the bill and trades know, the labor movement. And I understand how important it is to work every day to find solutions for workers in their greatest need, in the greatest time of need. We need a mayor who, who is in a position to make things happen. We need a mayor who wants to know today and every day that not, not only we are the 99%, but we are arguably the most deserving of that group and the most desperate for undivided attention for 2012. For the men and women of our union, I urge no recall. No! Because trust me when I say this, we simply cannot afford it. City. This week um, we're starting to do the year-end summary of what happened last year. Last year unemployment in my city went down 2%. Last year we created 5,000 new jobs in the city. And last year uh, we really started working on some major projects like the uh, building of the RN Army Base. And we're going to be fighting to elect the next president of the United States, um, somebody who's been fighting for jobs and fighting for us. So um, thank you for helping to unify my city. Thank you for your support. And I will always be grateful. Thank you. Thank you.